welcome back to the tiny treehouse with me daisy now today we are going to be making some homemade bird feeders that you can hang in your very own garden now with us living in the forest we see lots and lots of birds and wondered how we could help out so let's go discover how to make our very own bird feeders <music> To create your bird feeders, you will need some bird seed, a tray to pour your bird seed into. Now, if you don't have a tray, you can use a plate or even just some newspaper they've got lying around the house. You will also need a toilet roll holder or six. You will need a knife and a set of scissors. Now, you might want to look for this a little bit, guys, because they might be a little bit sharp, so you need to be super, super careful. And finally, we need some string and the most important part otherwise we're not going to have a very sticky bird feeder we need some peanut butter so all we do is we start off we get our tray like so Ta -da. we get our tray and we take our bird seed and we're going to pour our bird seed into our tray now you might need a big strong adult yes love that mess fantastic sometimes you might split the bag but you know what guys that's fine we're going to pour the bird seed into the tray like this Ta-da! And we're just going to put you to one side, out the way. Well done, Daisy. That, you know what? It lives there. We're going to make multiple anyway. This is fine. So we want to flatten it out like this, okay? You can go and live over there. There we go. We'll all be coming in here over like Snow White. So we've got our bird teeth in the tray. Might want a little bit more. Magic. Okay, we are going to take our toilet roll holder and our peanut butter. Now all we're going to do is we're going to cover our toilet roll holder in peanut butter so we're going to stick our knife in like this now again guys if you do need an adult because maybe you're tiny small and you need an adult to do this part make sure you ask them before we get started because we don't want really to carrying sharp knives around the house okay and we're just going to cover this Ugh! we're just going to cover our toilet roll in peanut butter like that look how thick that is mm. lovely jubbly cover it all the way around make it super super thick we want the beards to get super, super full off this. Okay, I'm gonna add a little bit more. Now, as you can see, I've just dropped that straight in the bird seat. But before I start rolling it around, I wanna make sure it's fully, fully covered like this. Nice and thick, nice and thick, nice and thick. There we go. All the way around, lovely. Ooh, smells really nice. Fabulous, last little bit, there we go. Blech. Marvelous, get right in there, make lots and lots of big scoops, lots and lots of mess. We want to have loads on there so that all the bird teeth sticks to our bird feeder like this. And then all we're going to do, perfect, well done, Daisy. Marvellous, excellent, fabulous splotch. All we're going to do is roll, we can hit that, that's fine, is roll our toilet roll holder covered in peanut butter in our bird seed. So I'm going to scoop it all up like this. <gasps> this looks amazing. It actually looks really tasty. If it wasn't bird seed, I'd be full, fully involved. I'm going to dab you in and we want to absolutely cover our toilet roll holder. There's a few gaps, so I'm going to go back in for an extra dab. There we go, dab, dab, dab. And if you're joining in with me, you want to make sure that it's completely covered. Okay, cover it all the way up like this. Now, before we put it in our garden, we need to make sure that we can hang it from something. And to do that, we are going to need our string. So we take our string, we find our scissors. Come on. Okay, we find our scissors and we're just going to chop off just a little bit of string here like this, like this. Chop, chop, there we go. We're gonna take our string and we're gonna feed it through the middle of the bird feeder. A little bit fiddly, so again, if you do need an adult, that's no problem. Now we're gonna tie a little knot just at the top here like this. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Pull it nice and tight, like that, there we go. And here we have it. That is your bird feeder ready to go. So all you need to do now is hang it on a tree on the shed, off the edge of a swing, off the side of your house, wherever you want, wherever the birds all come to. You wanna hang it there and then hopefully we can start doing a little bit of bird watching. So hang it somewhere in your garden, feed the birds. You can make as many as you want. They can be this size, they can be this size. There really is no end to it all. And you can get your friends and your family involved and put them all over your garden, ready to go. 
Well, guys, I think I'd best go and clean up all this mess. But thank you so much for joining us today. If you have enjoyed this video, please make sure that you like and subscribe. And we will see you next time.